The Roo Motor Car Company was an Australian company set up to produce automobiles from Australian sourced components. It was founded in 1917 by Rupert Jeffkins, a local car racing identity, and W. B. Fowles, a Sydney-based engineer. Jeffkins had achieved international fame in 1912 as Ralph De Palmer's riding mechanic in the second annual Indianapolis 500. They led for 195 of 200 laps before a Conrod tore a hole in the crankcase two laps from the end. Jeffkins and De Palma pushed the crippled car across the finish line in a futile endeavor that brought the crowd of 80,000 spectators to their feet. Sadly, Indianapolis rules mandated that all entries move under their own power, so De Palma's final number of laps is recorded as 198, the push across the line bringing them only to the beginning of the final lap. They officially finished 11th. They received no prize money, but photographs of the dramatic push from the fourth turn to the finish line were published around the world. Jeffkins returned to Australia in 1914 with films of the first two 1911 and 1912 Indy 500s. He toured the country narrating the films and publicizing his other American automobile exploits. In 1917 Jeffkins and William B. Fowles built two prototype «raceabouts» with minimalist two-seater bodies. These featured locally made 1,600cc twin cylinder, horizontally opposed engines that were designed and built by Fowles. Jeffkins and Fowles used the first rib for test and promotional tours of the eastern states of Australia. Once enough capital had been raised, Jeffkins and Fowles planned to mass produce two models, the Raceabout and a better equipped Standard that had more substantial bodywork and lower gearing. The «Raceabout» was meant to retail for the same price as a Model T Ford. A third Rue was under construction when the major financial backer withdrew support due to the difficulty of sourcing materials during wartime. Jeffkins attempted to revive the concept in 1929, but it did not progress beyond the blueprint stage. Fowles produced the engines for the Southern Cross cars in the 1930s. <laughs> <laughs> 